So I'll be starting the car off. I'll use a clean uh, options. So this one will uh, remove uh, previously installed bundles in the car off. And then the next will be uh, pre prerequisites for the uh, bundles. How do I know this? This is a prerequisite. Is I basically uh, found those uh, details on the readme of the example projects which came with the uh, Caraf distribution. Okay, so let's check. Okay, now it's already started. We will run the pre uh, prerequisite prerequisites. installed this uh, the dependent uh, features has been installed so the next is to install the, the project we built earlier we basically will install the bundle only not a feature so we have an ID over here we'll try to start this by bundle start Okay, now it's throwing some exceptions because it needs some dependent features. So as you can see, it says uh, uh, Jackson Jaxar RS. So uh, I've looked into the dependent uh, the sample project from uh, Caraf. It's basically what it needs is a CXF. So what I'll do is uh, I'll show you where I took the repository so from the feature dot xml file so there are some some repository i need to have so i'm just going to copy this i need to install this repository before installing the i already have it in the troubleshooting commands over here so i'll just copy this one the latest mean anything any late the latest version so i'll install this repository first then following that i will install the feature cxf feature okay so why do i need the cxf is if we check in the feature.xml file, the project which we are trying to replicate is this one. So this clearly have a dependency towards a CXF. So that's why we are installing a CXF. And there are other bunch of dependencies. I don't want to install them one by one. So I'll just install a CXF alone. All right, the next one we will probably need is the Aris Blueprint. We'll check on that one later a feature has been installed so the next uh, step is to check whether we can start the bundle again okay this time is throwing a different exception it's saying a blueprint so this is where we will uh, find the feature for the blueprint and then install it okay so basically there are few features but we will be installing this feature instead Install. it's done and now we will try to re uh, restart our uh, bundle again we'll check the status okay it's uh, it seems to be active so we'll try to go to the browser and see if we can navigate to the uh, api okay as you can see it works so if you put some text there okay something went wrong but uh, basically it works so far it's uh, something of a bug on the api beside that it works so that's all uh, thank you very much.